well, we saw things cooler and gloomy for the weekend. And unfortunately, as we start our new week and even our new year, not likely going to see much in the way of change. So as we get that look across the Ohio County traffic cams, we're still seeing these light snow showers come on down. But the good news is notice how there's really not much, if any, in the way of accumulation. Really, all I've been noticing is you can see just along the edge of the road, across the Fort Henry Bridge, and even a little bit around the bend at the US 250 interchange. So roads still in pretty good condition this morning. Just be a little bit careful on exit ramps and going across any bridge this morning. But for most of us, road temperatures are just at freezing. About 33 is our road temperatures here in the Panhandle, but as cool as 29 in the Carrollton and on over to Millersburg, where you see those light shades of blue. So a few slick spots possible north of I-70, but as we progress through the morning, as a few snow showers continue, and as those road temperatures continue to drop, might notice a few slick spots here and there. So make sure to slow down and leave plenty of space between you and the other cars around you. Other than the snow, cold start to the morning as well. 32 is our average as of right now, with our feel like temperatures likely going to stay in the 20s throughout the morning. So definitely make sure you grab a coat, even grabbing a hat, a pair of gloves, not a bad idea as well. Since we stay in the 30s throughout the day, really only maxing out in the upper 30s with our feel like temperatures in the mid to low 30s by the time we get to the afternoon. And unfortunately, colder trend likely going to stay with us actually through much of the week. Really the only day that we have the potential to be above average comes for our day on Wednesday, but pretty much all week. We should notice our temperatures stuck in the 30s, but what I'm noticing is a few days like Wednesday into Thursday and even Saturday into Sunday with temperatures dropping that likely indicates we could see a few systems try to roll on through this week. So just a quick hitting Alberta Clipper this morning, but then Wednesday into Thursday, as temperatures drop, could see some mixed precip give way to snow showers on Thursday, even Saturday into Sunday. That is a system that I'm going to be keeping a very, very close eye on throughout the week, since it could bring us some snow accumulations by the time we get to the weekend. But for at least today, just noticing a few snow showers moving on through the heavy snow into Pennsylvania, so you can see for Cranberry over through Greensburg and down through much of western and central Pennsylvania. So most of us not seeing heavy snow showers and then we do see sort of weaken on out the further way they move through the lakes. And even by the time we get to lunchtime, most of that should see start to see some rain mixing in once temperatures get back above freezing. By dinner time though, we see the rain showers changing back into snow showers and even overnight completely back to snow and all the snow showers are out of the area by the time we get to 9 p.m. So just clouds and cold temperatures overnight. So first thing tomorrow morning should be about 25 up into Carrollton as well as Cat is as our cool spot, but still as warm as 20 into Chester, Wheeling and on down into St. Mary's. But should notice temperatures fairly similar today. We'll max out just about 38 degrees, but we'll see clouds in the morning give away to sunshine by the time we get to the afternoon. Even a few pockets of sunshine likely will stay possible Wednesday, but we see that next round of drizzle and flurries give way to a few spotty snow showers early Thursday morning. 36, partly cloudy for you feel good Friday with sunshine during the morning. Then precip returns Saturday evening, giving way to snow showers overnight and on into Sunday morning. 